Jesus. Who the hell are you? My senior. I don't want to help. You don't speak English. Great. Look, I need to find someone. Her name is Samantha. She looks a bit like me, I suppose. Well, more like me than she looks like you. I see more no. I say not by that. I'm not sure you understand me. I'm looking for a town or a settlement. You know, busy place. Many people. I am I saying that called Harbour? That is to be. That's about that. Oh my. Say no more. Lead the way. Look at this wreck. All my gears trashed. No water, no rations, unarmed, in the desert on another planet, following a purple faced alien with bug eyes. Oh well, if he's all the way out here, surely it can't be too far to the next settlement. Peaceful out here, isn't it? Sleeping under the stars like this. Takes me back to Afghanistan. Jesus, what's that? Like nine years ago. It's basically an entire lifetime. Feels good to be back. Killer Haplon Fonte Lima Kalima Maneon Fonte Sipta Bila Where are we going? Is she talking to us? Stop asking annoying questions. Fan capto lipta sonila Sima gone. Bel Afghani lan simni buna. San sima fonti gani. Sep lasso. Kilan fan kunama gipta simi. Gani fon zulan gold harbor. Gon lipta sani mosa. Enough of this. What'd you just do? Where's she gone? What? What are you talking about? I'm sitting right here. No, that shouldn't be. That's not the way it works. You shouldn't remember. I shouldn't remember? You've done this before? She must be adapting. Have you ever done that 
that to me? Or someone that I know? Quiet! That's the last time we'll speak of this. Am I understood? Do you understand? Is this place? What? Huh? Village Beckel. What? Oh, those tokens. One moment. I've got one here somewhere. Ah. There you go. Okay. Frank, you better be here. Getting closer to some sort of civilization. That's a yes. You call it a cold harbor. Oh, you are kidding me. You speak English? Only little. Me listen, me understand better. Why didn't you say something earlier? Very tired earlier. No, not so tired. Fine. Well, tell me something about cold harbor. Big place. Many people. Sure. So, what is this place anyway? I mean, why is there this portal underneath the ground that led me here? We not know. We have not enough money to travel far. We only come hold harbor for how you say, uh, no limit, Texas hold them. <laughs> how do you know what that is? Very popular and cold harbor. Win money, lose money. Very painful, very fun. Hmm. Maybe Samantha's got something to do with that. Where can I sign up for a game? Very high building. Man in office, show you. Cold Harbour. You welcome. I go now. What? That's it? You're not gonna show me around? No. No time. Already late. Well, thanks for getting me this far. Good luck. Try not to die. You don't remember me? You're not Frank. 
Oh, sorry. I haven't got my human face on. How about now? You're him? You're the guy from the station? The grumpy old git who fell over? You're Frank! I should box your ears in, you terrible bastard! Okay, now settle down. I thought my brother gave you my apology. It doesn't stop me being any less mad about it. By the way, thanks for meeting me at the entrance, making me walk around this place on my own. How'd you think I was going to find you? Uh, sorry, uh, I've been a bit snowed under. There's been a lot of new customers interested in vaping round here. Does it look like I care? I haven't got time to mess around. Have you got what I'm after? Come on, I've got to get back. Right, of course. You're going to need to use this bracelet. Put it on your wrist and link hands with the person you want to switch bodies with. Pretty simple, really. Oh, but just FYI, you can only use it once. Just saying. What do you think I'm going to do? Make a hobby out of swapping bodies? Well, you won't be the first. All right. So, how do I get back then? You're going to see me off? What do you mean? Just go back the way you came and use your return ticket. Return ticket? You do have one, right? No. Crap. Come on. Just give me a new one. Oh dear. Uh, sorry, I don't have one. What? No, 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 bullshit. Come on, hand one over. I'm serious. Those things cost an arm and a leg. Does it look like I'm made of money? Look, your best bet is to speak to the Ed Council. Explain your situation. I don't know, charm them. Who knows, maybe they'll take pity on you. Let me ask you a question. If you must. That time I told you I was visiting someone in the hospital, but couldn't remember who or why. I was there visiting someone, wasn't I? Someone close to me. And you vanished them! Her! The woman from underneath your house! Mum! Donna, you're so confused. A silly little girl. You're lucky you have someone like me to look after you, to put up with your nonsense. I wish I never met you. You're poison. Careful. No, I'm done listening to you. I remember them. Why? Because you're mine, and they got in the way. Now shut up, unless you want to end up like the rest of them. Excuse me, are you two here to sign up for the poker tournament? Watch out, he's dangerous! What's going on here? Are you with him? He's a murderer! My daughter has a very active imagination. Please. You're coming with me. She's mine!
Right. I'll just come back later. So let me get this straight. You've swapped bodies with someone younger, fitter, and healthier than you. You've shaved 20 years off your life, dodged a heart attack, and you want to switch back. Because... Do you always do this? Pry into other people's business? Sometimes you just need to hear it from the other side. That's all I'm saying. What are you doing here again? Oh, don't you know? I'm here to keep you company. Crack a few jokes. Share a few stories. I need to get out of here. I can't believe I killed him. You'll always remember your first one. You should be lucky that you know he deserved it. Hello? Hello? Guard? Can we talk? I'm not supposed to be in here. There's, there's been a terrible misunderstanding. You're wasting your time. They probably can't even understand what you're saying. You can wallow in your own self-pity if you want, but I'm not giving up yet. I've got a daughter to get back to. We know. That's the tenth time you've mentioned her. You don't have a family? Yeah. Married. A little boy as well. Divorced, I take it. Or are you one of those mums that just leaves a kid with a dad while you do your own thing? Oh, shut up, will you? You don't even know what you're talking about. Oh, I know all too well, believe me. Just stop it. Both of you. There's no point arguing. Of course you'd say that. You're the reason we're all in here. You're the murderer. Wow. Harsh. Yeah. So sorry it was a bit. If you both think this is my fault, I won't blame you for throwing me under the bus. It's not like I've got anything left anyway. No, look. I'm sorry. I'm just stressed, that's all. I know you've been through a lot. We should stick together. He's right. It's only a matter of time until we're questioned. It won't help to be at each other's throats. Let's just see what tomorrow brings. Hussan doth rinta. Hal Sulan. Las futa pim ganifa. Mol yurif sit kim han. Suni falima kasabron hulan sika fil himakutan. Lusa man. Simna luta mon fika prinokisan. Foli kuna gari man fispa. Luka kon gari. Mira don. What's he saying? Nothing good. Huka fon pisatula ini komi. Pita man sutalon farima. Kunu, pita man yute fakali no fika plum notika, pita man foko basa. Sami gondi ma punu, 
Lon sik fam halikin. Luka min filaman gipt suka. For the high crimes of trespassing and murder in the first degree, I take the power that is vested in me by the city of Gold Harbor to sentence these intruders to death. No! Stop! It was me! I killed him. Let John and Mina go. They had nothing to do with this. Donna. Silence! This chamber need not hear from you. Solomon. Wait. Don't you want to know how we got here? You will find out. Let Donna and John go, and I'll tell you who sent me here. <laughs> that won't be necessary. I do believe we've recovered your entry vehicle. Butika Vasika! It's only a matter of time before we learn who sent you. Authenticate! All right, now! Get down! <laughs> There's an opening. Come on, let's go! Kill and Kuna! are still ringing. This is mental. Did you see that? Just keep moving. They'll be coming for us in here. We need to find somewhere else to hide. That thing that exploded. That was yours. How do you know they bring that up out of the ground? What? I didn't. I'm just winging it like you. Are you serious? I thought that was part of some grand plan. So we actually almost died back there. We got lucky. Look, we're not out of the woods yet. They've sounded some sort of alarm. The whole city will be on alert. This cannot be happening. What are we going to do? Just run. Shit. Run! Keep going. Don't stop. What are we going to do? I didn't do that in my old body. Oh, I think the table broke my fall. Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure I landed directly on the concrete. Ugh. What the hell are you doing in my pub? Samantha? Who are you? Minutes, Black Ops! Behind here. Go! Let's go, Omni. Zinni Danu. Flag. Primni Nok. You can come up now. You're Samantha. How 
Haven't heard that name in a long time. So let me get this straight. Peter Hale sent you. That's right. Little Pete. Oh, that's a blast from the past. And weird. I'm surprised he still remembers me. I'm, what's it been, 40 years? You mean you're not childhood sweethearts? <laughs> what? No, I mean, Pete was okay, but no. He didn't think that, did he? He did pour his entire fortune into find you. Shut up. Is he rich? What am I going to do when I get back? You've been through a lot. Do you have anyone you can stay with? A relative or a friend, maybe? Everyone's dead. I feel like I should be crying. I should be, shouldn't I? You need some time to process what's happened. Listen, I don't know what to say to you. I'm sorry you came all this way, but I don't want to go back. I didn't want saving. My life's here. Maybe 20 years ago I would have been jumping for joy, but not now. Too much has changed. I've got a husband, kids, this place. You understand, right? I want to. I'm sorry that Pete is stuck in the past, but Jesus, it was 40 years ago. Let it go, mate. Life moves on. Some people don't want to let go. Well, I feel sorry for them. How can you feel happy with your lot if you're always looking back? It's not healthy. Right. <laughs> Look at me, the philosopher. No, you are right, though. I think I've been guilty of that. I wanted this job more than anything. I thought that it would change things. <sighs> what a mess. People have been hurt. Killed, even. Shit. Amy. Dan must hate me for what I've done to him. And for what he doesn't know about. Jesus. What's wrong with me? Okay. Armchair philosopher, maybe, but definitely not a therapist. Sorry. I'm just having a mini meltdown here. Been there. Take it from me. It's never too late to pull it back. Anyway, what shall I tell Hale? If I get back, that is. Not that I give much of a shit anymore. <laughs> tell Pete that... I don't know. Tell him it's very sweet of him to do all this. Actually, don't say that. It sounds too condescending. Just tell him that you're married with kids, but from time to time you still think about him. Something like that? That works. I'll tell you what. If I survive this operation, I'll come round and make sure you're okay. Alright? So you're definitely gonna swap back into your old body? I can't just let Jack die. About your daughter, though. Didn't you say child services would take her away? I don't know. Okay, it's getting on. I can't keep the bar shut for much longer without starting a riot. Plus, happy hour is starting soon, so this place is gonna get hectic. We get it. You've done more than enough. Thank you. Okay. Well, listen. The only way you're going to get out of here is through the portal chamber. What's that? The entrance is this big, ostentatious opening that looks like a flower. I mean, you really can't miss it. I know it. That's the way I came in. But guys, it's no cakewalk, all right? It's heavily guarded, probably even more so after what you did earlier. I'm not sure how you expect to get past them unnoticed. We don't. 
We'll just barge in through the front door. Well, good luck. Okay, we got two armed guards. What are you thinking? Take them out? It's too risky. That's got to be a last resort. Someone needs to create a diversion. I can do this. John! Hey! Fellas! What's he playing at? Come and have a go if you think you're hard enough. Oh shit. John, idiot. Okay, let's move. Donna, go back and get John. What? Are you crazy? Go. Come on, let's go. Are we just going to walk here in silence then? What do you want to talk about? I don't know. Let's start with the fact that we all almost died back there. It doesn't matter. It's done now. Donna's right. And it's probably a good idea none of us speak of this again. So, we just forget this ever happened? It's better that way. I don't ever want to think about that place again. John, listen. There are people who will make you shut up, alright? Take it from me. Fine. It's not as if anyone would believe us anyway. I don't know what you're complaining about. You got what you came for, didn't you? Have you decided what you're going to do?
What do you want? You killed me. You let me down. Get out of my house. I've come to give you one last chance to redeem yourself. For what you've done. You killed them all! Get out! But I can bring them back, Donna. I just need something from you. A promise. A contract. When you eventually meet your end, five, ten, fifty years time from now, you'll join me here. You get to live the rest of your pathetic life with those who you call family and friends. But after that, you're mine. Forever. No. I won't do it. I don't care what you say. I'm not doing anything for you. You disappoint me, Donna. You hear me? Get out! I never want to see you again. And you never will. What a complete mess! You've really embarrassed me here. I vouched for you, remember? I gave you your shot and this is what you do. As I said, she didn't want to come back. You expect me to believe that? I've had enough. We're done here. I'm putting you in a different department. It doesn't seem like I can trust you with anything important. <laughs> Don't bother. I quit. I only came so I could have the satisfaction of saying it to your face. <laughs> now that is funny. Surely you, of all people, should know I can't allow that. What are you going to do? Have me whacked? Just try it. Maybe you should look at these. I imagine they would make for good reading material for the people down at Scotland Yard. You set me up. It's just business, Hughes. Now do as you're told. There's a good girl. Home's a rotten turnip.
Thank you.